magician. Magician. Member of the Magic Castle, as seen on Masters of Illusion, and performing member of the Freak Show Deluxe. One of the founding members of Who's Line, and is currently working on producing his own show at AX, Myth, uh, Legends of Burlesque and Magic. Yeah. And if you go to AX, try to get tickets to his show. It is amazing. Unless it coincides with our panel. <laughs> Which it did last year, so that was a problem. Comfort. Comfort. Hello. Of, yeah, of which there are both. Your okay. boobs? Yes, mine. <laughs> okay. Sold. Okay, our first game is called Scene Styles. Now, how this one works, for those of you who have never seen the show before, is they're going to act out a mundane scene, either a con scene or something every day. And then I'm randomly going to throw anime or video game styles at them, and they have to change the scene according to that style of that genre. So they could be going grocery shopping and all of a sudden it's Helsing and they're attacked by zombies. Mm -hmm. Or ghouls. So that's kind of how it works. Or Cook Drake and the yeah, Sailor Moon and they suddenly have to fight the villain of the week. So, and it will constantly change and I'll keep throwing new styles at them. And it's all junk I got from you guys at the con. Woo. Yeah. So, I'm going to need some suggestions for you guys. <laughs> that guy raises his hand He's too really true. quick. I'm going to need some suggestions for something mundane from you guys. So, pretty nice and generic. Oh. Yes! Walter White body pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Shut it's up, It's your Sean. fault! It's your fault! Okay, so yeah, please raise your hand if you have any ideas for me. I like a couple of them for every, uh, every uh, game on here, so that way it gives me a good range to pull from. I can predict. Being late for school. Waiting for the airport security check. I will say this. Hands, please. <laughs> okay. Waiting in traffic on the Nerds. 405. Traffic on freeway. Yes, I am, Sean. I got one TV roll panel going to five dollars. Anyone get 3DS? 3DS. Five dollars. Play up ten dollars. Okay, actors, quit trolling for street passes. Get your butts back on stage. This is a damn puzzle. Before I make you do horrible things. Well, more horrible than normal, anyway. Doing laundry at laundromat. It's not Sit down. Thank you, person who sent me their room number. Okay, I'll take two more if I got any more. You were the one who put our room subscribe. Check out the anyway. Sewing the cosplay and messing up horribly on it. Okay. Uh -huh. Sewing cosplay. That guy looks desperate. <laughs> Put it down. Trying to find a cell phone signal at the Marriott. Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> find the true source. <laughs> I'm kind of going with the soul signal one. It's kind of apt. <laughs> now, just at a point, who can relate to the cell signal problem? Not me. I got full bars. <laughs> All right. All right. Raise your hand. The person who said that, raise your hand. After the show, kill him. Lynch and steal his phone. Death first. Always more fun. Okay, so this will be for Sean. Fuck! <laughs> General attendance! You moved! <laughs> um, it's Sunday, everyone's hungover. I doubt anyone actually cares. We'll go with Ruthie and Steven on this one. <laughs> <laughs> and what was this about a barrier? Uh, <laughs> Sean, get your butt up there. Yeah. Unfortunately, you're going to have to share mics, so, because I'm going to need to be yelling out like an idiot. Okay. So, go ahead and start whenever you're ready, and I'll start throwing ideas out. <laughs> oh, Maybe you need to believe in the heart of the cards in order for this to work. <laughs> Wait, yours is actually real? What? <laughs> I got my cell phone from Night Vale. You want to sell imaginary stuff? Oh, thank you. <laughs> 
Maybe if we try in the bathroom. Um, I hear if you put it in the toilet, then you get something. Either that or a ninja turtle maybe, pops maybe out. I'm not sure. Like, uh, signals, we'll like get, we'll get signal. Or we'll get. I, summon Captain Planet. Or yeah. <laughs> My little pony. Do you have signal? Uh, no. <laughs> we can always put it in a cake! <laughs> now I just want to eat it! Disney fairy tales. Oh, cell phone. Cell phone. Why won't you connect, cell phone? Oh, oh bars, let them grow. Cell phone gets calls like cell phone. Go and get some text like cell phone. It's the greatest phone in history. No one connects like cell phone. Grand Theft Auto. I guess we'll all just sit together. Ensign, set course for the cell phone tower. <laughs> Captain's log. It's been three days. <laughs> Still no signal from Starfleet. Or my cell phone. Not sure how my sets are going to go through. <laughs> and on that day, we received a grim reminder that we forever live in fear of the Marriott. <laughs> jokes in Grand Theft Auto 1. We just had to... is one person is going to be asking the other contestants for a date. This will be for uh, one person asking and then three contestants. So one person is kind of left in limbo. Oh well. And so basically they will ask questions and then have to answer, but the people being asked are specific anime characters or video game characters. So they ha And the person who's asking the questions is going to have to guess who they are at the end. Okay? That makes sense? Yeah. Raise your hand if you're confused. Don't make me stick the octopi on you. <laughs> All right. So, Ruthie, you're going to be trolling for dates here. Oh. <laughs> she always? <laughs> well, I could be a jerk and have Draven do it. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay. Please don't bring that. For those of you who missed my show last night, I have a very creepy dating history. <laughs> okay, so are you guys going to share the mic? We'll share the mic. Yeah. Okay. So go ahead and meet you when you're ready, Ruthie. Sweet. Sean's going to assist me, but I'm going to be the potential date. I got it. I didn't volunteer for this. <laughs> I'm kind of scared what they're up to. <laughs> 
scared. Whose <laughs> lies, anyways, are anime presents puppet shows. <laughs> um, do you, yeah. Sean, do you need the mic? No. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. <clears throat> Go ahead. Let's be real. We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret, but let's put it past us. For science, you monster. <laughs> okay. Contestant number two. Um. Okay. If I told you that I lived in a cottage out in the woods with no neighbors, would that creep you out or turn you on? <laughs> I can't say I have much experience with cottages, but I do with a lot of restaurants. Did you say restaurants or restaurants? I said restaurants. Okay. <laughs> well, moving on, because I have six nipples. <laughs> Contestant number three. Oh no! Where did you go, my little friend? I know how humans make humans, and frankly, it's ridiculous. That, of course, requires that you have a human to begin with, which I think somebody should have been fired for. Mm -hmm. That's why I've come up with a much better way. going around and just find strange and unusual creatures. My ideal pet would be one of those that I can make a lot of money off of. Oh, uh, okay. So can Are you strange and unusual? Well, I I'm a talking pony, so... Uh, I'd say uh, the galaxy hasn't seen anything like that. <laughs> can this number three? <clears throat> Excuse me, miss. Does that... Does that wall look particularly weak to you for some reason? Uh, does it? Okay. I'm just, I'm just kind of worried because we lost one last month and I'm just... Okay. Just keep an eye on it for me, will you? Contestant number three! <laughs> Are you going to eat me and or disembowel my organs at any point? Do you value your life, miss? <laughs> Would you be willing to volunteer if we need a sacrifice? <laughs> I appreciate it. You start Monday. <laughs> okay, number one. Okay. Uh, contestant number one. Good news. The test results have come back. <laughs> what test results? <laughs> We got a situation here. Beam me up. Beam me up. Oh, it's not working. Oh, this is gonna take another two minutes. Okay. You can't get QT, a final resort! You can't get final resort, QT! Anymore. Okay, contestant number. Contestant number one! <laughs> Uh, 
I don't have a clue. I think you're from Doctor Who, but I'm not sure. Uh -huh. It's Doctor Who versus the Titans. Okay. Uh -huh. And then, no idea. We now have about 30 more people standing outside of there. One please, come oh, in, no. come in. Come in, please. At the half hour mark, we will sacrifice a virgin. So that's about 50% of you. <laughs> Item. That's awesome. All right, so who are you, Wayne? GLaDOS. Oh, nice. Oh. And Brian? Ah. I have some space Alright? Okay, so now we're going to play a game called Redux. Now how this one works is they're going to act out a scene. And one of them, no, I'll do it, will sit there and as they're acting will go, change. Which means they have to change the line they just said. <laughs> Jake could derail the scene. I could do it five, six, seven times in a row and have them keep coming up with the same new version. It's kind of fun. Uh -huh. Now, but for this, I need some suggestions from you guys. Another scene they can act out. I can either go with something that was used before, if you guys want to continue, or if you got anything new I can use to torture them with, please give me ammo. Mundane, generic scene, uh, con convention-related, fan-related, Or basic Potter. anime cliche scene, like character fight scene, or schoolgirl scene, or something. <laughs> and do not shout. <laughs> Hands, please. I have found that usually card or monster, ba monster battles work really well. Um, fight scenes like Sailor Moon style, something with bigger transformation, something like that. Something silly with lots of people work really, really well. Sword comparing competition. I have that as a quote, but I will use it. It's like weapons comparison. It's like someone comes in with a sword and I come in with a Gundam. Anime character's reaction to fan fiction. I have that elsewhere, too. <laughs> Naruto, get in here! Please, doing come in. Have a seat. Doing an improv panel at a convention. <laughs> in the realm of possibilities, please. <laughs> Where are you guys going? Fine. Go be horse. Go be horse. Always funny. Yeah, no. Soccer game. Soccer and or sports game. I'll go with that. That's good. <laughs> Yay, new victims. <laughs> Transfer student. Transfer student in new school. All right. Uh, yeah, you go so wrong. <laughs> Remember, this is not an H. <laughs> 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 yeah, <laughs> love triangle. <laughs> <laughs> We're all in love with Sean. <laughs> <laughs> Just be glad that one of your love interests is from the Adams family. You'd just be dead. <laughs> Trying to get noticed by Senpai. Oh. Oh. Okay, you know what? I, I cast my vote for that one. <laughs> Try to get noticed. Senpai will notice me. You love all the Senpai notice me jokes. She starts playing! I'm not arguing that. <laughs> Yeah, I think we're probably gonna use it because it's one of the better ones on here for this. <laughs> Trying to get somebody get... to notice you. <laughs> yeah, get somebody to notice you. Okay, so, eh, Ruthie, you're you're trolling for somebody. Don't drop the mics, please. <laughs> Anyone else can actually join in this for the silly of silliness? And who wants to be senpai? No, no, this is on, Ruthie. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be me. Senpai's imaginary. What's wrong with it? No, this game works as a group. Yeah. Sorry. I think Wayne's the sexiest, so he should be sent by. That means Sean's volunteered. Yes! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. I'm sorry, you're going with the, you're being voluntold. 
to do this. Uh, the other mic is on right there. Yeah, we need the other mic. We need one more person. Or, or can it work with you? Read up. I yell change, you have to redo the line you just said. All right, Stephen volunteered. <laughs> Unless you want to jump in, Wayne. Yeah. All right. <laughs> or it'll be just be nice and ambiguous. We'll figure it out. We're the students. We're the students. All right. So begin when you're ready. You know, it, it's not like I want him to notice me. I just, I made, I made extra love chocolates. That's all. Change. I, I mean, I just, I have extra condoms. That's all. No. Okay. Now, class, I want you. To remember that uh, your homework for tonight is pages 3 through 10, um, and don't forget you have the test on Tuesday, which will be covering everything that we learned in class. He's got such a good voice. Excuse me, Susie. No, Susie in the back? I, I need to see you after class. Change. Uh, I need to see you out in the hall right now. Mm. Change. I need to see all of you. <laughs> Please put your blouse back on. What's so special about Susie? Uh, she has things are going pretty well. Change. Ruby. She has a large vagina. <laughs> Oh my god. One on one student interview. Me. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, with, I'll interview. With randomly me. selected me. students. Me. 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 <laughs> me. In order to assess. Their Please, training. I hate my job. Me. Change, Steven. In order to assess their physical fitness. Change, Steven. In order to assess their attractiveness. <laughs> I'm. I'm. I'm principal. Princi by the principal. I'm out of this game. Class changed. Wayne. <laughs> Shit. We just broke the fourth wall. I've been noticed by the principal. <laughs> Does this mean I'm still in this game? <laughs> now, now, class, I want all of you to notice Susie. That's, that's right, Susie. Stupendous, utmost, zealousness, and young. That's what we strive for in our students. Perky. And, and perky. And, and perky. I don't think there's a key in that. <laughs> it's not like I want to be noticed anyway. I just... I have daddy issues. Change. It's just... I have therapy issues. Change. It's just... I have uncle issues. Oh. <laughs> Could you please start evaluating Spider-Man here? <laughs> but... <laughs> it's tighter than his. Change. Draven. Son of a bitch. <laughs> but I look better in spandex. <laughs> Prove it. Change. Draven. You're right, but you got a nicer set of racks than I do. <laughs> None of your other students are in the school uniform. <laughs> I could be in the school uniform. I've been in the school uniform. Terrible things in the school uniform. Change, Ruby. I've done things only the internet knows in the school uniform. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Has no one noticed Susie is not here today? I seriously, I haven't been able to find her at all. Has, does anyone have any idea where she is? Susie's just an ass butt. Why would you 
you describe yourself like that? Uh, <laughs> there she is. Susie! The, with the teeth and the red <laughs> Principal, I found a love of my life. I must quit. <laughs> You ass. <laughs> All right. Well, Ruthie won't be the only one up here with a. By the time we're done with this. <laughs> Fill in and, blank. and all of us will probably be in some form of therapy. <laughs> mm -hmm. like black butler characters on how to catch a predator? <laughs> yeah, you said on uh, your profile that you were a demon willing to make a contract with a 14-year-old boy. Have a seat. <laughs> 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 Normal hotel guests who are not who are not aware that, but now found out that there is an anime convention going on. <laughs> regular, hotel guests. regular hotel guests uh, coming to hotel and oh, anime con. <laughs> uh, can we put a star next to that one, JJ? That's quite versatile, actually. <laughs> the X Games come back. <laughs> The X-rated games start up. <laughs> Ruthie, you're not helping. <laughs> Grandma accidentally rents Bible Black. Grandma stars in Bible Black. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Sean Chiplock looks for Walter White body pillow. <laughs> What's for? He owes three of them. I am the fluffy. <laughs> Preparing a human transmutation. Oh, human transmutation. Okay. Oh my heart. Oh God. <laughs> Becoming a Vampire Nazi 101. <laughs> <laughs> that was just for you, Ruthie. <laughs> was that Freudian or just oops? <laughs> Okay. Do, do you guys have a preference? I, I really like the straight vanillas in a, finding out they're at a hotel with a convention going on. Yeah. Lifetime. I also like Lifetime as well. I have another idea for the Lifetime one. Oh. Let's, do, let's do regular people at a convention. I've never seen any of those. <laughs> <laughs> Expo back and in Anaheim. Two years ago with Helen Alexander Anderson giving a sermon outside. Yeah. Oh. And they and the religious people do get it. <laughs> okay, so you know how this works. Act up scene, pull out quotes, and let it derail itself from there. Have fun. Yes, sir. Why are half naked girls running around and are they 18? It looks like that one's a <laughs> I, I'm sorry, dear, what did you say? <laughs> what? I don't want to have this discussion again. For the last time, it's bigger on the inside. <laughs> That's what I'm wondering. <laughs> I, I, I'm just saying I, I could go find out. I it, ears. Why? Why <laughs> ears? What are those? <laughs> what is Uncle Billy doing? Are the, is he uh, drugs again? <laughs> I tried asking one of the con staff for help uh, how to like navigate through all these people. Always bring a banana to a always party. Said to was, <laughs> all he said to me was, people have been swinging at me for years. They always seem to miss. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
That's amazingly accurate, actually, Rowan. I, I asked Uncle Billy why he was walking around them, and Uncle Billy just told me that I am justice, I am might, I am Batman. Well, these are some people you recognize out there, then. I know Batman. I, I know Batman. But, but what I remember most about him is the future is like a Japanese game show. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> All right, look, maybe we can ask some of these nice people what's going on. Uh, oh, he just told me I'm I'm no Wayne Brady. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, look. Anyways, we're just yes, 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 Uncle. Yes. <laughs> Honey, if I see you touching anyone, I'll chop your balls off. <laughs> What is that? That's a A guy. The screen thing. This person's been coming up and yelling at me. And I don't understand what he's saying. Can you translate for me? What is he saying? He's saying, there is trouble in the forest and your brother is right in the middle of it. Oh no! You gotta come back! Yeah, you need to save your brother. Well, excuse me, princess. I was having a conversation over here. Why don't we go? How do you cake? <laughs> All right, look, I think let's let's just go to our room. I checked the program guide and it said, how's your day? Because I'm a potato. <laughs> All right, well, anyways, look, all right, thank God at least the maids were here. At least they cleaned our room for us. And oh, look, there's a note on the pillow. Get off, get, get off my head, girl. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think that was hotel staff that was in here. I think it was one of those people. Those freaks? Yeah, I, I think they actually dress as maids. I don't know why. <laughs> guys, I heard something. What? Grandpa gave me this ball to remember him by. <laughs> it's okay, guys, because I, I know I can't even tell, like, who is what or everything, but if you look look in the back of your, of your pamphlet, see, there's a little quote right at the bottom that says, if you get stuck, just ask this question to anyone. You're a girl, aren't you? Amazingly oh. <laughs> self-inferential on that one, yes, yes. Well, anyways, you know what? I just want to come up, I want to, I want to meet one of these freaks in the audience. So let me just come up here okay, and I... Okay. Sir... I was doing a bit. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, you're really pretty. Are you a boy or a girl? Uh, <laughs> it's not working. It's not helping! He exists! Billy, Billy. No sex while you're in school. Or else you'll die. Or else. So, uh, I couldn't help but notice you. Um, are you single? Because I was looking up your bio on that on that anime dating website, mm -hmm. and I read the part that said how you are in the bedroom, and I remember that it said, "Hey, fastest man alive." <laughs> Damn it, Jim, I'm a doctor, not a con staffer. <laughs> so ticked off, I'm molting, and you're the nasty egg people that stole all my waffles. Uh -huh. Seriously, though, a round of applause for the con staff that had to deal with you guys and your smell for three days. <laughs> and, and us, and us. It's okay, it's almost over, I promise. <laughs> Okay, this one I need two things from you guys. One, a suggestion for two of them to seem wise to act out, and then two of you to make all their sound effects. <laughs> 
and uh, I'm doing suggestions first, sound effects second. Now, how this works, if you guys get picked with the sound effects, you cannot be afraid to make complete asses of yourselves. Woo! Woo! <laughs> yes. Can I pick the sound effects? Ruthie already got in. She beat you. You can pick one, I pick one. Fair enough. Woo! Okay, first, I need suggestions for two of them to act out. Because remember, two of them are acting, and one of them is basically one's going to make sound effects for one of them, and the other one for the other. So, and make sure you don't, don't crisscross your sound effects when you do this, okay? Struggling to make pizza. Making pizza. That's new. <laughs> Because mm -hmm. in this day and age, no one makes pizza, they just use their phone. Oh wait, the cell service. Oh. Oh. Sorry, I, I kind of left myself open for that one. Explaining Yowie. No! Oh. <laughs> that doesn't have sound effects. <laughs> Explaining Yowie. 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 Trying to start up a broken Gundam. Uh, oh. Over here. Parents at Yowie Con. Uh, oh. Parents at Yowie Con. <laughs> New people with some new ideas. <laughs> no leaving. Explaining what furries are to parents. Oh. Explaining furries to parents. Team Rocket and trying to explain that you don't have any Pokeballs. <laughs> 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 yeah. Alright, last one with the scouters. The Saiyan Bell movement. <laughs> 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 That is creepy. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> hey, Sean, how many people have you passed? Anime characters learning to twerk. How many people have you passed? Oh. <laughs> You've only got six. <laughs> I've got... Some imagery is not needed. <laughs> so I need my sound effects person from this side so that they can make the biggest fool from themselves and be loud. That's not very loud. Over here! Alright, I'm gonna give a shout out right now to Kai's. repairing a broken Gundam just because I know how this game works and it's more fun when things blow up. Yeah. Uh, do you guys have a preference? I, have, I like parents at Yowie Con. Yowie Con parents! Yowie Con parents! Okay, parents at Yowie Con. Now, sound effects. Raise your hands. Now, remember, you're going to have a mic, which means you're going to be making lots and lots of noise. Don't stand there and be bashful. I mean people who are very exuberant and not afraid to make complete asses of themselves. Over here! Oh, yes. <laughs> the alone will make your noise. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I've never seen you like this song before. Well, to be selected anyway. I see me. I see you. 
You see me? Mom, no. Mom, you know this. You know this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't pick my <laughs> 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 I really like your vest, but I'm going to go with that. Uh, <laughs> oh. My name is Aiden. Hi, 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 Aiden. Okay, so they're going to act out the scene. You are doing the sound effects for Ruthie. Dana, you are doing the sound effects for Steven. Correct. Don't re... The best thing to do, don't react to what they're doing. Make your own sound effects and make them react to you. <laughs> That's how I found out the best way to make this thing work. You know, I, I've been here for a few hours and I have seen no ice. No athletics, no ice. I didn't know that Yowie fans could breathe them. Sea ponies. <laughs> <laughs> 